the time U.S. rockets accidentally bombed Mexico. In 1936, Keith Rumble was a prodigy from Mission, Texas, graduating high school at 16 and heading to Rice University. Despite the financial struggles of small-town Texas during the Great Depression, Keith devised an ambitious project to raise funds for his father's American Legion post. Keith, an Eagle Scout with a passion for rocketry and stamp collecting, proposed a Boy Scout project to send mail across the Rio Grande by rocket, the first international rocket mail flight. Despite the technical challenges and bureaucratic hurdles, the project moved forward, scheduled for July 2, 1936, to coincide with the dedication of the Legion's new building. The rockets, though primitive and made from laminated cardboard, managed to send mail between the U.S. and Mexico. The first rocket exploded mid-flight, scattering mail across the river. The second rocket successfully crossed but overshot its target, ah! causing a stir in a Reynosa bar. Subsequent rockets had mixed results, with some causing minor fires and others landing safely. Despite these setbacks, around 2,000 pieces of mail survived, becoming valuable collectibles. The project was a remarkable success for a small-town initiative during the Great Depression. Years later, Keith Rumble became a government rocket scientist, and in 1961, McAllen celebrated the 25th anniversary of the rocket mail flight with another cross-border launch, highlighting Keith's early genius and the town's unique place in rocket history.